What's up, G.I. Joe fans? Welcome back to the MIB Master Museum. I'll be your curator today. Guys, we got another cool one for you. Another real cool set from 2003. Bring you the Timeless Collection 40th Anniversary. And this is first in the series, 1964 to 2004. The G.I. Joe Action Soldier anniversary edition and these sets are reminiscent uh, from the sets that were sold back in the uh, 1960s um, the vintage ones that were sold back in the 1960s and Hasbro um, did a reproduction mock-up of these beautiful sets from the 1960s where you could actually buy all of the uh, all of the uh, little outfits it came with you know accessories equipment there's his army manual and it was really cool and what you got though and I'll, uh, I'll show you um, back in the 1960s you would just get these beautiful little box sets of figure I mean uh, uh, um, of equipment and accessories you didn't get the figure Hasbro kind of did one better and and we'll show you in a minute but they added more to this set and it made this set kind of pricey I got this from uh, Super Kmart back in 2003 and uh, I paid $39.99 for this set and they did I want to say five to six to maybe seven waves uh, of these sets. You can get the Marine set, the Frogman set, the uh, Action Pilot set, and you know, all these sets, and they were just coming out left and right. I wanted to go after the very first because they were, they were starting to get on my nerves. <laughs> it was just too many to collect. So once again, being a collector back in that time period, especially a G.I. Joe collector, you had to kind of pick and choose what you really want to go after. Uh, I, had, I know some collectors that wanted to complete this particular uh, line, uh, collection line. I was not one of those collectors because there was too many other um, G.I. Joes out at the time that I simply wanted to add to my collection. So I had to make a decision, and I, I stuck with that decision. This was the, the only one of that line uh, collection line that I bought because it was the first and uh, there's a ton of these guys out there I've seen these sets go for uh, well over a hundred dollars I've seen them on Amazon for uh, for maybe around 50 or 60 dollars it, it depends on the condition um, this is C10 museum quality right here but it depends on the the, the condition it, it depends on who's the seller and how badly the seller wants to sell and how badly the buyer wants to buy <laughs> so I would I would say anywhere between sixty to a hundred dollars for this set is perfect you know uh, Coswell collectibles is a is an excellent source it's my go-to source especially when uh, I don't have a GI Joe so GI Joe's that that have been out of production for 20 to 30 years or longer I always go to Coswell collectibles first because they themselves are collectors and they keep everything in pristine condition let's have a look around the box here um, this this is packaged once again we're talking about packaging styling uh, this was put together so beautifully this is why I can't take anything out Here's what he you get with this a field jacket, an M1 rifle, bayonet, grenades, cartridge belt, and army field manual. And that's what comes with this particular G.I. Joe. And this is from the, the Timeless Collection line. That beautiful field jacket. You can see he's even got the got his tag in there. Grenades. 
Here's the big coffin box. And we'll show you why you need that coffin box. Let's turn this guy around. This is, it's heavy. And, oh boy, okay. This is why you need it, right here. Let's get you a blown out look. And here, on the back, is your, your G.I. Joe. And he's got a, he's got, comes with his own manual. He's got a, his cap right there. Got his basic uniform on. Get you blown out look at the box again. Let's get you a year. Yeah, 2003. And here's your backstory on the G.I. Joe uh, 40th anniversary collection. And that was the cool thing about these these sets they came uh you, you know you could dress your gi joe up and put him in other uh uniforms he could be anything you know he could be an astronaut he could be um an, a frogman here he goes right there adventure it, marine he's in the field right there and here were some of the other sets that you could get see also look for the action soldier with combat attack see it, it these lines went on and on and on and on as you can see I mean they, they were coming in waves and waves and waves so it was just it was so many of these guys and I think after a while some collectors just got tired of collecting them um, because they've just well they're they're they were becoming a bit redundant because you would get the figure you would always get the figure uh, either dressed like this or if he was a, a Navy guy, you, you know, he was dressed in his regulars. There's his pilot would be in the orange jumpsuit, you know. Um, you know, your standard uh, Joe uniforms for these for these particular branches. But there was, there was a lot of these. And you can still find this uh, these on Coswell Collectibles, Amazon, eBay. Like I said, it's just, they're out there, guys. Uh, I just wanted to have one of them. And this one's been in my museum collection since 2003 when I purchased them uh, from Super Kmart way back when. So it, it was just a it was a cool figure. I had to have one so I could say, hey, you know, I got one from that line. It's a cool line. I may get a few more um, from this particular series, maybe just to complete this series. But uh, overall, I think there's about maybe 15 or 16, maybe 20 of these these sets. Um, out there if not more I mean they just they just kept bringing these guys out guys what do you think of our timeless collection 40th anniversary set do you have some of these sets are you looking for some of these sets these sets are relatively uh, like I said easy to come by they're awesome um, they display beautifully make no mistake about it they display beautifully uh, they look great, you know, especially if, if you're an out-of-the-box type of a collector. Uh, you'll have a ball, you know, putting this guy's equipment on and, and displaying him. Uh, if you're an MIB collector like myself, then guess what? This box looks awesome. Uh, everything about this box is absolutely gorgeous. So you'll have a ball um, displaying it. They, it displays beautifully either way. So you can't lose. It's just a, um, a fabulous set to have. And we just wanted to have one here at the museum. Uh, we will probably be getting more. Um, only because of the museum, our museum. If I, if, you know, if I didn't have my museum and I was just a collector, I probably wouldn't. But I want to have more so I can show our viewers and our public um, and our subscribers that are really into our uh, our channel and visits our channel. You know, we have so many people and subscribers from all around the world uh, watching our channel. So we're very, very thankful and blessed to be in that position. And uh, 
that's that's really cool. So we we, we kind of want to bring bring some more of these these collectibles here, and that's that's what we are. Uh, you know, we're a museum first, and because of that, you know, we we, we want to make sure we're getting some uh, some awesome um, collectibles into the museum because we are a uh, we do protect I should say the historical value and integrity of uh, of GI Joe and a history of GI Joe and that's what it's all about and as a a GI Joe collector um, that was one of my primary goals Let's see around there you can see his knife right there guys we like to thank you for uh spending some time with us and going over the 40th anniversary uh, G.I. Joe box set here timeless collection we have some more fun for you we want you to stay tuned you know the routine guys God bless and keep collecting